What's up guys, this is MTBL and as we reach to the end of 2020, we have reached our 300 subscriber milestone and as a way to celebrate, in this video we are going to be going through all my video guests or what I use to make all my videos, one by one. So, let's get it started. So let's go into my room. So this is my official office or studio. Just close the door. So this is my room. I know it's really small. You can tell. You don't really have that much space to, I guess, stay and sit in. Because that's a sofa, that's a shelf, table and all my things right there. So yeah, this is basically where I make my videos all the time. So that is where I stand or stay when I make my like meme review videos and my table was here before or just at the start of 2020. So yeah, we had a lot of adjustments of the table, the shelf, the sofa and all of those things because despite how small this room is, it is um, really small but you do have to remember that this is temporary because we are staying in the Philippines and this is not our home, it's just rented. So we are just staying here for a little bit, a little bit more time and we will move to a new place and hopefully my room will get bigger there because I seriously can't stay in this room anymore. I am bigger than this room, literally. So first we have the tool or the uh, machine I use to edit or upload all and store all my video files so we have my laptop first of all I guess this is my most expensive gadget I have yet so this is an Asus Zenbook 14 I bought this early July or June for online classes and it's a pretty nice um, laptop you see me had a review which you can click right there to take a look at it it's it has all of the in-depth um, specs of it so yeah build qualities pure metal this there's it's just beautiful you can take a look at inside so that is basically how it looks like yeah so i'm gonna go there and watch my review of more visual more information of this laptop so we have my mouse um this crappy thing really cheap it doesn't it does have a brand it works and it just works it's not it's not required to be that good of course it's lane i don't like anything on lane because you need a battery for that so yeah it's just pretty it's a pretty crappy uh, mouse um, I will replace this with my package right there, which I will be unboxing after this. Okay, so speaking of mouses, this package, um, it came just yesterday and it is my Christmas gift. I'm opening advanced for you guys and just to add up to my equipment list. So let's unbox it. Okay, so this camera angle is replaced with the product because my tripod, which will be featured again later, isn't really all that nice. So this is the stuff right here. I'm going to just spray this alcohol, by the way. And we have our... Okay, so this is the second wrap second wrap so we have a wrap uh, inside a wrapper so I haven't unboxed something for so long I forgot how to unbox them okay third wrapper oh man the packaging though it, it's pretty damaged but it's okay if it's if the product's okay then it's okay so so this is a my new mouse it is the Logitech G 102 it's um not something too op in terms of gaming but still i'm not really a gaming fan and yeah this is my first logitech 
and yeah, it's surprising I've never had a Logitech before, which is pretty surprising still. And let's just get it. Ha! Ah, first thing here, we have our paperwork, and we have a sticker. I don't know where I will be using that. And yeah, this is probably the warranty, guys. Okay, let's get the paperwork taking a look. So, yeah, I guess it's official. Um, keep playing Logitech, all of those stuff here. And um, yeah, let's get the sticker out because I'm just nothing to explain more. And the mouse itself, wow, the line is really long. So, let's get it. So this is the mouse, it's white, it's yeah, nothing too surprising. Yeah, I guess this is it. My new mouse, Logitech G12, G102, and ah, there is another one on my list. So next we have our laptop cooling fan. So yeah, it's it's pretty dusty already. But it's uh, a few months ago because I realized that my laptop doesn't do cooling that much considering that my laptop isn't a really gaming focused laptop and it's the fan just doesn't work as much as it should do so we I got another fan so we have like five different fans so we have the four small and the main fan we have the switches at the back here um, you can control a little bit. It's not that the quality, nah, it's not good. At least it's useful, and I cannot buy something like that OP, that expensive. Considering that my budget, which is given from my wallet, it doesn't have that much stuff. So yeah, yeah. So this is another part of my equipment. Um. Okay. The next equipment. Um. Uh, this thing. So what is this thing? This cute little weird like thing so this is a i think it's called the usb adapter or usb port so yeah my laptop my asus zenbook 14 as i will bring to you right now it doesn't have that much usb ports so on the right side it has one usb type a and on the left side it has only one usb type a and a usb type c port so there's only a total of two USB Type A. You might be asking, isn't that enough? But actually, no. Because if you think about it, I have my mouse, so that is one port needed. I have my keyboard, that's another port needed. And especially, I have my cooling fan, which is another USB Type A plugin. So I need three. And sometimes I even need my USB. Wow, it's pretty weird stuff. I never bought it this before. So it has a total of one, two, three, four USB ports and it has a micro USB port as well. So I use this to make the best video quality as possible. Next, I have my audio equipment now. So this is my first ever microphone that I bought. This is a, uh, I don't know this, I don't know this brand or anything. It's, really cheap as well um at least it says bm800 so i'll just say that it is a bm800 mic yeah it's a very beginner microphone i just saw a lot of reviews online about this thing the quality not that good that's why i switched to my new mic which i bought early 2020 this thing this is way more premium feeling than the bm800 just by looking just by looking at both so let me just get that apart. This is the Samsung C01 condenser microphone, so it's an XLR version. Um, I think apart from XLR, there is also a USB Type A version. But since I already have my audio equipment, which will be featured later as well, yeah, this is my Samsung C01 condenser mic. Um, it's pretty useful. I've done a few covers of this. The audio quality just gets better and better 
So yeah, this is my second mic and I think the one I will use in professional videos but not in this because I'm featuring this, so yeah. So, in terms of audio equipment, in, things are actually really complicated, way more complicated than video equipment because I've never done anything like singing a cover for example before. Here are my equipment, so we have the newer Phantom Power then click over there and that would be the time I have unboxed this thing which is like months ago so yeah it's not that um, advanced it's just a simple one I've got two phantom powers though this is the official phantom power and that one's just the copycat I would say and here is the power unit so it connects to the phantom power this is the XLR cable, so it's the XLR to a, I don't know, I don't know what do you call this thing. Whatever it's called, so this to this. And the thing is, I cannot plug it in my phone or laptop directly, and it doesn't work, because I don't know where does this connect to. So I had to buy an extra adapter just to keep that running on my laptop and phone so this is a audio plugin it's really blurry the focus though and this is the earphone so you plug in here and if you see this part there are three lines on the plugin part so that will put in my laptop that's why i've been doing months and months of research of all this equipment and we are not yet done so a few moments later this thing i have got is extra this is a ear green ear green ear green and xlr to xlr so this is this two are to plug my mic on this side and plug this side on the phantom power so we could connect my mic to my phantom power and the other line is to connect my phantom power to my laptop it's so advanced so advanced Okay, so we have switched our camera because now I will be introducing something you haven't saw for a very long time, which is my main camera gear. So this is my phone. It's been behind the scene for all my 160 plus videos. Let me just take the cover off. I have bought this last year and this is a Realme 5 Pro. So this is how the phone looks like. Yes, it is from last year. And I pretty much love this phone so much. The specs, the price, all of the you know things. It's just I think it's just perfect for all their use. Now, of course, shooting here is my mom's phone. I have to borrow for that. And yeah, I don't know which quality is better because shooting here is the Samsung A71. And you click a review over there that I've just um, had. So yeah, this is my main camera. A lot of fingerprint, the fingerprint magnet it is. It's a real me and I never had this brand before. So pretty surprised on how it actually works and pretty surprised on the performance of this thing. It's still useful. Nothing has broken except the little cracked screen I've cracked last time I dropped my phone. So yeah, this is my phone and my main camera gear. All right, I don't know how many items I have already reviewed now. Here we will go to the stands. This is my tripod. It's to let my camera be on a certain height and angle to be able to shoot, I don't know, angles, camera angles. And as I've talked before, the camera angle of this thing isn't that good because this is the only the best and the one and only tripod, the good tripod I could find and it broke because the quality it's all plastic and if you see here I'll just so you won't break it, there you go the head where you put your phone in which is you know releasable it's cracked Meaning I can't stabilize my phone staying on this thing, putting on top of this thing, and it will just fall off because the thing connecting to this thing is just overall just a bad thing. Stand, so this is my mic stand. 
Oh, this is large. I got it with my BM800 microphone. So yeah, this is my audio stand. It's really long. Not gonna lie. Can extend the further because of this thing. So yeah, I've got it for um, an ear already, I think. So yeah, this is pretty nice friend. It's had some broken parts too, to be honest. The thing right here, that's just that doesn't doesn't work anymore. But I'm still using it because I don't want to buy another one, and buying another one is just a waste of money. Okay, last but not the least, um, I don't know if this is power or not. So here are my earphones. Um, this is a. JBL something 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 my sister got me for my birthday present and it does still work and I love this so much I've been using this for all my musical projects cheers to this and all my other video audio equipment that I have for making for reaching this 300 subscriber milestone 300 bro wow so that ends to the end of the video. Um, please click the like button if you enjoyed it. Share it with your friends. And yeah, if you haven't subscribed, um, please subscribe to get more of our videos like this one. And I will see you next time.